Hi, welcome to clickmyproject.com. Let's see the title of our project. Visual Cryptography for Biometric Privacy Preserving the privacy of digital biometric data that is face images stored in central database has become a paramount importance. This work explores the possibility of using virtual cryptography for imparting privacy to bio biometric data such as fingerprints, images, iris codes and face images. In the case of face, a private face image is directed into two host face images that are stored in two separate database servers such as that the private image can be revealed only when both sheets are simultaneously available. At the same time, the individual sheets images do not reveal the identity of private image. A series of permits on the XM 2VTS and IMM face databases confirm the following. The first one, the possibility of hiding private face image into two host images. The successful matching of face image recognized structure from the sheets. The inability of sheets to reveal the identity of the private face image using different paths of host images to encrypt a different sample of the same private face and the difficulty of cross database matching for determining identities a similar process is used to identify fingerprint images and iris codes prior to storing them in the central database let's see the data flow diagram of a project so it's a level 0 first of all we have to load the image we have to give the primary key username and password so this image is shared the shared images that is that image is shared and select the host image and encrypt the that host image into shared image with the username and password save this image into database so this is a level 0 and level 1 is a authentication so here load the image we have to give the uh, correct username and password and retrieve the image from the database based on the primary key and decrypt the image then retrieve the original image username and password if it is valid then the result will be valid user otherwise it is an invalid user so let's see the demo of our project this is a home page so here admin can process new user can enroll and old user can authenticate here first a new user going to enroll by using web camera or by using load image he can choose the photos otherwise he can capture the photos by using web camera so now I'm going to load the image so by using browse button we are going to choose the photo then we have to give the username and password like this so user enroll successfully and by using web camera how to refresh so enroll successfully now admin going to process the new users so password is admin here admin can insert uh, or delete the host images so for insertion he should give the host image path and he should give the image name So image name how to give 
So this image details has been saved. Now he wants to delete that host image means he should give the host name. Then he can delete. And log list. In log list. We have to choose the date when the user has been enrolled. So in this date, there is no new user and old user log list. So these are all the old users and new users. So these are these new users are enrolled. Now admin going to process this new user. So he should choose to process and that particular user details are viewed here and shared image of this photo is viewed here. We have to choose the host images. So encrypt. This image is encrypted successfully and the second image, second shared image is encrypted successfully. Then this details are has been saved. So you should choose the photo. And primary key we have to give the valid primary key. Username then it's going to authenticate. User details are viewed here, then retrieve from the database, decrypt the this image, then username is decrypted here and password is decrypted here and retrieve the original post images, original user images retrieved here. Then result is valid user. So this is a result of our project. Thank you.